Uh, listen, the word of God is quick. Before you know it, the word of God done went in there and it done did what it had to do. And you don't even know, listen, you don't even know that God done perform surgery on you until you think about what you're not doing anymore in your life. In your life. In your life. They're using the name, listen, they're using the name of Christ. They're using the name of Jesus, huh? To exploit you and I. And to, to, to exploit innocent people. Amen. To mislead and deceive people. Some of these, uh, some of these pastors, amen, with these mega churches. They've they've been they they have been hired. They've been hired to deceive and to mislead. Some of these, I'm gonna tell you something. Some of these mega churches are only holding facilities. Some of these mega churches are holding facilities to keep your mind captivated from seeing the true light. You go and, and look at some of some of these facilities. That these pastors have. These listen, these facilities, these these churches, they look like theaters. Huh? They look like theaters. Listen, they set up like theaters. They got big screens on, up there on the stage. They got a stage up there. A platform. Huh? And they have a our, most of them have a solo wheel type of uh layout for the audience. It's a solo wheel type of layout. It it looks like some kind of amphitheater where they do plays, where they have concerts, where they have concerts, where they have concerts, where they have concerts. They got a spell on most of these people that's in these in these mega churches. Listen, and their job is to keep to keep you spellbound and to keep you confined within those walls. Huh? That's what their job is. Until everything hits the fan. They know what's coming. Listen, these these these, these mega pastors, they know what's happening. They know what's coming. This is the Lord's house. No. It's just four walls and a roof. Until everything hit the fan. They are, they know that the mark of the beast is coming. They understand that the chip is coming. Huh? They understand it. That's why they're not preaching on it. Their job is to keep your mind occupied. It's all entertainment. It's all show. The Bible says that they have a form of godliness. But they deny the power of their up. Huh? They got a form. A form of godliness. An artificial life. A, a, they, they preaching about a false Jesus. They not preaching the true Jesus. They preaching. They not preaching the gospel. Uh, the true gospel. They watering down the gospel. Get some anointing. You put some up here. Woo! Man. Woo! Put some money. Put some anointing on his money. You put something up here. You put. <laughs> they, their job is, is not to offend anybody in the sanctuary, but to keep you coming, keep you in, in, interested, keep your mind captivated, huh? And enthralled. Keep you looking up to them. The Bible said we should not think on man. Shouldn't don't think on man more highly than than what the scriptures say. We lift these men, we 
we lift these men and women of God up above measure higher than what they ought to be according to scripture the Bible says that Satan himself is transformed into a, an angel of light listen Satan ain't gonna come to you as Satan huh he gonna come to you as a false light he's gonna come showing you all the glory of this world Huh? He gonna show you that all the glitter in the gold. Huh? 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 This is my divine power. But I'm a generous God. I can make you rich beyond all measure. I will make a warlord of all Greece. You will carry my battle standard to the heart of Europa. Your Athenian rivals. We'll kneel at your feet. God has been doing the most Hard to be humble when there's so much people out dangling the rope I keep my faith if he call me or now boy I pick up the phone G.O.D. is my designer, but I stay Gucci, so ain't no need to act Prada. No key, I might have a problem, but it's all good. I give it all to the fuck. The end result of you selling your soul for the gold and the glitter. He ain't gonna listen. He ain't gonna show you the end result. He ain't gonna show you that he's gonna take your soul in the end. He ain't gonna show you that you're gonna be cast in the lake of fire with him in the end. Huh? Listen, the majority of these ministers on TV, a lot of them on YouTube. I mean, listen, you got to be able to differentiate between the artificial light and the true light. Satanist, huh? You, hey, hey, you, then you wrote a book too then, right? You got a book with blood on it, huh? You Satan, huh? Who created you, Satan? Who created you? I come in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Spirit. I I come in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Spirit. It's renewed. It's renewed. No, 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 no brother. You, you told me to ask the question. Stop interjecting when you, I'm answering. No, let I said answer. so a new one. Let me answer. That's brother. in the Old Testament. You please let me answer. You ain't going to control me how I answer. I'm going to let the Holy Ghost lead me, okay? You don't have no Holy Spirit. We got a point. I was tired of being fed milk. Listen, these, that's what they, listen, that's what they giving. They giving out milk. They're, listen, they giving out milk. That's why the majority of these people in these churches, they gonna stay babies. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna be no spiritual growth. The messages that they are, that they are delivering, amen, are designed to keep them spiritually babies. Huh? It's not designed to grow them up in God. It's designed to keep them lukewarm. Huh? We know what the scriptures say about being lukewarm. We need to read the word of God. We need to follow, make sure we follow in Christ. Huh? And not men. Huh? We need to make sure we're following Christ. Make sure you're following Christ. Huh? Examine the word that's coming out the man and the woman of God. Follow the word. I don't care what they, listen, I don't care what they say. Jesus said, take heed that no man deceive you. Listen, I just told you, Satan had ministers preaching a false light, an artificial light. We need the true light. We don't need no artificial light. 
Listen, the artificial light ain't gonna do nothing. The artificial light is not going to change you. Notice that Jesus said they're gonna come in his name, meaning they're they gonna come using. They're gonna come using his name, but they are not going to be of Jesus. I just told you who I thought I was.